All right, listeners, ready for another deep dive? I am pumped for this one. Today, we're going to be talking all about the Mac Mini M4. I mean, this thing is an absolute beast. Yeah. You know, it's incredible how much they pack into such a small form factor. But Well, and that's what I want to talk about, the size. I mean, this thing is, how small is this thing? Uh, the current M4 Mac Mini is only 7.7 .7 inches square and 1.4 inches tall. 7.7 .7 inches square. It's tiny. Like, how do they even fit all that power into something that small? Yeah, well, the M4 chip is incredibly efficient. It's able to deliver desktop level performance using way less power than previous models. And but okay, so that efficiency is great, but it comes with a catch, right? It only takes AC power. Exactly. So unlike a laptop, which has a built-in battery, the Mac Mini is completely reliant on that AC outlet. So the power goes out even for a second. Your whole workflow is toast. Yeah, and it's not just about complete outages either. You got to think about power surges, voltage fluctuations, even just those little flickers. You know, all those things can cause problems for a sensitive machine like the Mac Mini. Okay, so I am sensing a but coming here. What's the solution? The solution is a UPS, an uninterruptible power supply. And specifically for the Mac Mini, I think the Energy Intelligence Power Station 200 is like the perfect companion. Okay, so tell me more about this power station. What makes it so special? especially for a Mac Mini. So the key here is that the Power Station 200, it uses what's called a common power bus. That means that when it switches from grid power to battery backup, there is absolutely zero delay. Zero. Zero. Most UPS systems have a tiny lag, a fraction of a second, but that can be enough to disrupt a device like the Mac Mini. Ah, I see. So with this power station, it's like the power never even goes out. The Mac Mini just keeps humming along happily. Exactly. And that's crucial for a machine that you rely on for work, creative tasks, anything that demands consistent uptime. That's like having a safety net for your entire digital life. Ah. <sighs> Okay, I'm sold on the concept, but let's get practical. How long can this power station actually keep a Mac Mini running? I mean, in a real-world power outage scenario. All right, so the Power Station 200, it has a 60,000 millifar capacity. Okay, and in English, that means? It translates to 192 watt hours. And since the Mac Mini M4 uses around 39 watts at its peak, Eek. you're looking at several hours of backup power, enough to ride out most outages, and even finish up some work. So you're telling me I could actually get some work done during a blackout? Absolutely. That's the goal, to give you that peace of mind and keep you productive no matter what happens with the power grid. All right. I'm liking this more and more. But, you know, portability is a big deal for me, too. I mean, what if I want to take my Mac Mini on the go? Like to a coffee shop or to a client meeting? Is this power station going to weigh me down? It's actually pretty compact and portable. It's about the size of a hardcover book and weighs just over two kilograms. Two kilograms. Mm hmm Not bad. And it can deliver up to 200 watts of AC power. So more than enough to keep that Mac Mini happy. So it's powerful, it's portable, sounds pretty ideal. But let's be honest, a UPS is not exactly the sexiest tech gadget. Uh -huh. Is this power station just a big clunky box? Not at all. The Power Station 200 has a pretty sleek modern design. Like I said, it's small. It's got a durable aluminum enclosure. So it looks good and it's built to last. Hmm? Okay, so it's powerful, portable, doesn't look half bad. But beyond just keeping the lights on, what are some other benefits of using a UPS with a Mac Mini? Well, one of the most important is surge protection. Power surges, those can be really damaging to electronics. The Power Station 200 basically acts as a bodyguard for your Mac Mini, absorbing those surges and ensuring a clean and stable power supply. So it's not just about preventing interruptions. It's about protecting my investment. I mean, I learned that the hard way a few years ago when a power surge fried my old laptop. And those kinds of repairs can get expensive. Exactly. So a UPS is like an insurance policy for your Mac Mini. Mm. But, okay, let's go back to the Mac Mini M4 for a second. We talked about its efficiency and all that. But what are we really sacrificing by going all in on AC power? That's a great question. I mean, the trade-off is that you're losing the inherent portability of a laptop with a built-in battery. But for people who prioritize desktop-level performance and want a compact machine, the Mac Mini M4 is a great option. And when you pair it with the Power Station 200, you're essentially adding that portable power back in. It's like having the best of both worlds. Yeah. You get the power and capability of a desktop, but with the option for mobile power when you need it. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I think it's a really compelling solution for a lot of people. I think so, too. And I think our listeners are starting to see why this combination is so powerful. Absolutely. The Mac Mini M4, particularly when it's paired with the UPS, like the Power Station 200, it really represents a shift in how we think about workspaces. It's and no longer about being tethered to a desk. It's about having the flexibility to work from anywhere without sacrificing performance or reliability. Yeah, and it's about having peace of mind, knowing that your work is safe, even if the power goes out. 
So we started this deep dive talking about the power of the Mac Mini M4, but it seems like the real power comes from having a reliable power source to back it up. I couldn't agree more. In today's digital world, uninterrupted power is essential for productivity, data security, and just peace of mind. And for Mac Mini users, especially those who might face unreliable power situations, a UPS like the Energy Intelligence Power Station 200, it can be a total game changer. It's funny how we take reliable power for granted until it's gone. Right. I mean, for anyone working from home in a studio or running a small business, a power outage that can mean lost time, lost data, and ultimately lost money. Yeah, you're absolutely right. And it's not just about the major outages. Even those brief flickers or brownouts can disrupt your workflow. They can corrupt files or even damage sensitive electronics. Yeah. A good UPS is like a buffer that ensures a clean, consistent power supply, even when the grid is acting up. Thinking about how much we rely on our devices these days, it's almost like a UPS is becoming essential, not just a nice to have. I think you're right. And especially for Mac Mini users, you know, they often choose this machine for its power and its performance. So protecting that investment with a UPS just makes sense. And when you consider the peace of mind that it brings. Yeah, that peace of mind knowing that your work is safe even when the lights go out. That's priceless. Absolutely. Yeah. And with a solution like the Power Station 200, you're not just getting that protection, but you're getting portability and sleek design as well. So it's a win-win. You know, I got to admit, I'm sold. I'm sold on this Mac Mini M4 and Power Station combo. Mm -hmm. It's like they took the best aspects of a desktop and a laptop and combine them into this ultra reliable, super powered workstation. Yeah, it's a really compelling solution, especially for users who demand both power and flexibility. And as we move towards a more mobile and decentralized way of working, having a setup like this just makes sense. Well said. All right, <laughs> listeners, we've covered a lot of ground today. I hope you found this deep dive informative and engaging. As always, we encourage you to do your own research and choose the power solution that best fits your needs. And until next time, stay powered up. Stay powered up. Yeah, two kilograms, so about four and a half pounds, give or take. Okay, so we've talked about keeping the Mac Mini powered up during an outage. But what about all the other stuff I've got plugged in? Like my monitor external drives all that jazz. The Power Station 200 has you covered there too. It's got multiple outlets, so you can connect your essential peripherals and keep everything running smoothly. So it's not just a single device solution. It's like a mini power grid for my entire workspace. Exactly. And with 200 watts of AC power output, it can handle most desktop setups without breaking a sweat. Okay. I am seriously impressed with this little power station. Yeah. It's like the Swiss army knife of power solutions. Hmm. But let's shift gears a bit and talk about the Mac Mini itself. We've been focusing on its power needs. But what about its capabilities? I mean, this is the M4 chip we're talking about. Oh, yeah, the M4 is a beast. It's not just about power efficiency. It's about raw performance, too. This thing can handle pretty much anything you throw at it. Yeah. Video editing, 3D rendering, software development, you name it. The M4 can handle it. I've heard some buzz about its graphics and AI capabilities, too. Right. What's the deal with that? So the M4 chip has a really powerful GPU built in, and it's optimized for Apple's Metal Graphics API. That means you get super smooth performance in graphics intensive applications. And on the AI side, the M4 has a dedicated neural engine, which basically accelerates machine learning tasks. So that's like Siri getting smarter image recognition, all that good stuff. Exactly. The M4 is a huge step forward for Apple Silicon, and it makes the Mac Mini a really compelling option for professionals and creatives who need that extra power. It sounds like this little machine is future proof. Ready for whatever comes next in AI and beyond. I think so. Apple is really pushing the boundaries with their silicon, and the M4 is a prime example of that. You know, one thing that struck me in the article we read about the Mac Mini was how they highlighted its potential not just for individuals, but for businesses and institutions, too. Oh, absolutely. I mean, the Mac Mini has always been popular in those settings because of its compact size, its reliability, and now with the M4, its sheer power. It's a great option for things like digital signage kiosk systems, even light server duty. So it's not just a personal computer. It's a versatile tool that can be used in all sorts of environments. Exactly. And when you add in the reliability of a UPS like the Power Station 200, it becomes even more appealing for those mission-critical applications. It's like the Mac Mini M4 and the Power Station 200 were made for each other. I think you're right. They complement each other perfectly. They really do make a great pair. Yeah. I mean, it's almost like this combo is ushering in a new era of computing. Yeah. You know, one that's more flexible, more resilient, more mobile. I think you're right. It's about empowering people to work how they want, when they want, without being limited by technology or unreliable power. Well said. Well, I think we've covered just about everything there is to know about powering your Mac Mini M4. Yeah. Any final thoughts for our listeners? 
Just this, if you rely on your Mac Mini for important work for anything, really don't underestimate the value of a good UPS. It's not just about convenience, it's about protecting your investment, your data, your peace of mind. And with options like the Energy Intelligence Power Station 200, it's clear that you don't have to sacrifice portability or style to get that protection. Exactly. It's about having the best of both worlds. Couldn't agree more. Mm -hmm. Well, that about wraps up this deep dive into the world of the Mac Mini M4 and uninterrupted power. Oh. A huge thanks to our expert for joining us today and sharing their insights. It was my pleasure. And to all our listeners out there, we hope you found this episode informative and helpful. And as always, we encourage you to do your own research and choose the power solution that best fits your needs. But hey, maybe give the Energy Intelligence Power Station 200 a serious look. It might just be the perfect companion for your Mac Mini. Definitely worth checking out. Until next time, stay curious, stay informed, and stay powered up.